Okay, let's sit and meditate for a few minutes. Anam Pavana Sampakhtan. We have a lot of work today, so let's give the mind a chance to rest first. Because the mind needs a spot inside where it's, it's, it's still and it has a sense of nourishment and strength. Because otherwise things from outside come and eat away at our strength, drain our nourishment. And even when the, the work is good work, like today's work, you can end up drained if you're not careful. So try to have a sense of each breath coming in as being food for the mind, food for the body. And allow the breath to feed the body as much as possible. Most of us breathe only with a small percentage of what the breath energy can do. But when you allow the breath energy to flow all around the body, it's, it's good for the body. Helps to nourish all the organs. Helps make sure that the blood flow is good to every part of the body. When the body feels good like this, then it's a lot easier for the mind to stay here with a sense of well-being. And you can catch yourself. If a mood comes up that would destroy the good mood of the day, you just let it go, let it go, let it go. You don't have to get involved. When you start weaving it, then you find yourself entangled in it. It's like knitting a shirt or knitting a sweater. And if you have long hair, you find somehow that your own hair gets knitted into the sweater, then it's hard to get it out. Well, that's the way it is with our, a lot of our emotions. We allow them to knit themselves together, and we find ourselves entangled in them. So the best thing to do is notice okay, when a new mood comes up, is it a good one or a bad one? Is it something you want to encourage or not? And if it's not, untangle it as quickly as you can. If it's only a few stitches, it's easy. But if you've stitched a whole sweater, then it's hard to get untangled. So try to be with the breath and notice. If anything unskillful comes up in the mind, just let it go, let it go, let it go, and stay with a sense of nourishment. Because it's the sense of nourishment that keeps us from running off and trying to feed on those things. Or look for shelter in those things, look for some sort of protection in those things. We know, we're in a good space right now, just breathing here calmly. Could take this sense of calm center with you as you go through the day. And you find that it gives you strength so that the work of the day is good work. The Thai word for a festival like this is ngan, but you don't say that you're tam ngan, you say you're ruam ngan. Tamgan would be just to do the work, but here we're gathering together for the work. It's good work, work of generosity, work of virtue. So try to bring a sense of being nourished all day, and that it keeps the sense of well-being afloat. Because that's what this, these festivals are for, is to create a sense of well-being, a sense of fellowship. So make sure that the mind is in a good shape to maintain that attitude all the way through the work. Don't let it get distracted by other things. <laughs> 